Hello artists for the final stage of your Kadula Monsters in the City. We're going to have a transparency sheet, this clear piece of plastic, and we're just attaching it to the top of your page with a couple pieces of tape, like a hinge. It'll fill most of your page. Your page is probably gonna be a little bit bigger than the transparency, but that's okay. We're going to have Sharpies, and we will be drawing only on the transparency, not on this page back here, unless you have tiny details you're missing. Like, I wanted this to be a clock tower, so I'm going to add little handles to that with my Sharpie. Every table will have a couple handouts that give you some ideas for monsters. You don't have to make it look like one of these. You can always come up with your own. Just this lets you see the general style of Kadula monsters. So some of them look like different combinations of animals. Like that looks like it's part dinosaur. Uh, this one looks like it has cat ears. Some have tentacles. This one looks like it's part cat. That's part cupcake. <laughs> a cupcake octopus. They're, they're all silly. They're not meant to be scary. We're drawing on the transparency with the Sharpie to make your monsters. And this way you can see through it to make them better interact with the buildings. So I have one monster that he's biting the top of a building. He's chewing on it. Now, they're not trying to attack the city. He's just curious. So I would like you to draw three or four good quality monsters on the transparency and you can have them sitting on buildings, interacting with your city. It's meant to be happy. Then we open it. So your artwork's up here, transparency's down here. That's important. And so your monsters have color so they're no longer see-through. We're going to use oil pastels to fill them in. And since we're drawing on the inside instead of the outside, if you get on top of the black lines, it's not going to hurt anything. Just try to stay inside the lines the best you can with your pastel colors. Here I can color over my whiskers because it's on the inside. If we look at the other side, we can still see the whiskers just fine.